Hello ladies and gentlemen, Keaton here and welcome to the Tengu Trap Recap for the week of August 16th, 2015. I am writing down everything that we released on the channel for the week, so let us begin with Monday. On Monday, Joe continued to explore the world of Submerged, continuing to unlock certain landmarks, continuing to discover more of the narrative, and boy does he discover quite a bit of narrative this time around. So if you wanted to know whether all that scaling of the mossy buildings would be worth it, you should probably check out Submerged Part 3. On Tuesday, I took a look at a new game called Airscape, and I had quite a bit of fun with this game. A 2D platformer featuring an adorable octopus and some crazy difficult challenges. It's very different from anything I've played in recent time at least, so there's that. And once again, I do have a lot of fun with it, even though the game really kicks my butt. But at the end of the day, it's so cute, it's really hard to get mad at the game anyway. On Wednesday, Joe took a look at the latest build of Darkstorm. Now, he took a look at the VR missions, which seems to be sort of a retooling of the pre-existing levels, but maybe updated a bit with improved programming and whatnot. And I do believe that this is the build that the developers are providing to the public to go along with their Kickstarter. So, you know, if you enjoy Joe's video, be sure to support the Kickstarter as well. Moving on to Thursday, on Thursday it was Nuclear Throne Roulette time and that was one hell of a episode to record. <laughs> I can't really explain what happened in this week's episode, you just have to watch the insanity unfold before you. Trust me, it's weird. <laughs> on Friday we returned for more Dino Horde action in Orion, this time doing the Hell Map and I think we did relatively well this time around the ending which partly is thanks to the game breaking what can you expect from a one dollar game though am i right but still the final bit there just that final bit of just chaos the the chaos that ensues in the ending of that experience of that session is just oh, beautiful that's the type of moments you expect from a 99 cent game man mm, beautiful <laughs> On Saturday, we returned to Alien Isolation in Gmod. Now, this was the remade version, so the original creator decided to redo the entire game mode from scratch. So, so we took a look at the more polished version, I guess, of the uh, game. And we did a little bit of uh, PvP action there. And um, yeah, we had a lot of fun with it. Hopefully, the developer keeps working on it because it's a, it's a pretty fun mode. And I would love to see it more fleshed out, you know, more modes added or more features added. Maybe more maps. Maybe we can get a community going so we can get more alien maps. That'd be pretty cool. But nonetheless, if you want to just see us scare each other for a good while, that's the video to check out this week. <laughs> But anyway, that is the week in Tangu Drop videos. What can you expect in the upcoming week? We will be covering a new game coming out. We may have a surprise multiplayer video. That is definitely way up high in the air. That may not even happen. But if it does, it will be awesome, I'm sure. There is definitely a laundry list of things we want to get to. It's just we can't always fit them into our schedules. But I guess that's also part of the fun as well. You know, you never know what's going to happen next week. So as always, you should be sure to be caught up with everything that we released on the channel. So you can stay in the know and be up to date with all the latest Tengu Drop content. Everything that we released this week is in the description for your convenience. And uh, before I wrap this up, actually, I have a little news regarding the Tengu Drop Weekly Recap. This is the second to last episode that I will be doing of the Tengu Drop Recap. Yes, that means next week's episode will be the final episode. Don't worry, it's all part of a plan that we will be discussing more probably on the next Drop Pod. So. Hopefully it doesn't come as a whiplash to you guys when you hear us announce that later on. Uh, but yeah, there will be more details in the near future, so be sure to stay tuned. And in the meantime, once again, be sure to keep up with everything that we release on the channel. And to everyone who is caught up, thank you as always for your continued support. We appreciate it. And hello to all the new subscribers for the week. I hope you guys are enjoying the content. And with that, until next week, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you guys then for the final Tengu Drop Recap. Bye!